Hi, and welcome to this Internet Geography, Rapid Revision video. In this video, we're exploring the process of coastal deposition. We'll examine what coastal deposition is and the reasons why it happens. Coastal deposition is the process by which the sea drops or deposits sediment it carries onto the coastline. This sediment can include sand, pebbles, shells, and other materials transported from other areas by the action of the sea. Coastal deposition occurs for several reasons, and understanding these can help us predict and manage changes in our coastal environments. The first reason for coastal deposition is energy loss in waves. When waves carrying sediment lose energy due to a decrease in wind strength or entering shallower water, they slow down, and their capacity to carry sediment decreases. As a result, the sediment is dropped onto the seabed or shore. Next, is the arrival of sediment load. The sea transports sediment loads via processes like longshore drift, but deposition occurs when the volume of sediment is greater than the water's ability to transport it. This is often seen where rivers meet the sea or ocean, depositing loads of riverborne sediments, as can be seen here at the mouth of the River Humber. Lastly, human activities such as the construction of groins and breakwaters also influence deposition by slowing water movement and encouraging sediment to settle. Knowing why coastal deposition occurs is crucial for understanding the formation of coastal landforms and how coastlines should be managed. Why not test your knowledge of coastal deposition by taking the quiz on Internet Geography? Click the link above or in the description below. Let us know how you get on in the comments. Thanks for watching this Internet Geography Rapid Revision video. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel.